Have you ever pondered about our place in the universe? How small or large might we be in this cosmic sea? Our universe stretches far beyond the reaches of our understanding. The observable universe, the part we can technically see from Earth, is estimated to be about 93 billion light years in diameter. A light year is the distance that light, racing along at 186,000 miles per second, covers in a year. That's roughly six trillion miles. Yes, trillion with a T. The scale is mind-boggling, isn't it? But here's the kicker. What we can observe might just be a fraction of the entire cosmos. Some theories suggest that the whole universe could be 250 times larger than what we can observe. This means the universe could potentially span over 7 trillion light years across. These numbers are so large they seem almost meaningless. So, let's try to put them into perspective. If we were to scale down the universe such that the Earth is the size of a grain of sand, the observable universe would be about the size of a beach ball. But remember, this is just the observable universe. The entire universe based on those theories would be the equivalent of a ball nearly the size of Mount Everest. These staggering scales remind us of how much we still have to learn about the universe and our place in it. We are, after all, inhabitants of a tiny planet orbiting an average star in an ordinary galaxy, one among possibly two trillion galaxies in the observable universe. Yet in this vast cosmic sea we've managed to make waves. Our curiosity and ingenuity have driven us to explore the cosmos, to reach for the stars, to seek answers to the questions that have haunted us for centuries. As we delve into these staggering scales, it becomes clear that our understanding barely scratches the surface of the universe's inherent vastness. But this does not diminish our quest for knowledge. Instead, it fuels our desire to learn more, to explore further, to understand better. After all, we are the children of the cosmos, and the universe is our playground. Our quest to understand the universe has been a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity. From the earliest days, when we gazed upon the stars with nothing but our naked eyes, we've sought to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. The constellations, once the stuff of myth and legend, became our first celestial map, guiding us towards a deeper understanding of our place in the universe. As our thirst for knowledge grew, so did our tools. The development of the telescope was a quantum leap forward. No longer limited by the strength of the human eye, we could peer further into the cosmos than ever before. This humble invention would lay the groundwork for us to discover new planets, observe distant galaxies and deepen our understanding of the universe. In the 20th century, we took another giant leap. The moon landing, a feat once thought impossible, marked a new era of exploration. Standing on the lunar surface, we looked back at our home planet, a blue jewel suspended in the vastness of space. This perspective shift was a poignant reminder of our journey from cave dwellers to cosmic explorers. Our ambition didn't stop at the moon. We've sent rovers to Mars exploring its rocky terrain and searching for signs of life. We've dispatched probes to the outer edges of our solar system and beyond. The Voyager probes, our most distant emissaries, carry messages from Earth into the interstellar void. And let's not forget the Hubble Space Telescope, our eye in the sky, capturing breathtaking images of distant galaxies and nebulae. Each new discovery, each new image, is another piece of the cosmic puzzle we're striving to solve. Our journey of understanding isn't a straight line, but a spiral, constantly circling back, building upon what we've learned and pushing further into the unknown. We've come a long way since we first looked up at the stars, but as vast as the universe is, our curiosity is equally boundless. From our humble beginnings to our farthest reaches, our journey has been marked by a relentless pursuit of knowledge and understanding. In this grand cosmic theatre, where do we, the human species, stand? Ponder on this for a moment. Our physical presence in the universe is infinitesimal. On the cosmic scale, we are less than a grain of sand on an endless beach, less than a drop of water in an unbounded ocean. The planet we call home, the Earth, is but a pale blue dot in the cosmic expanse, as famously described by the visionary astronomer Carl Sagan. But what does this tell us about our significance? This is where we delve into the realm of philosophy, into the minds of thinkers who have wrestled with our place in the cosmos. Existentialists like Jean-Paul Sartre and Albert Camus have contemplated our existence in an indifferent universe. They propose that in the face of the universe's apparent indifference, we are free to create our own purpose. 
our own meaning. It's a liberating perspective, isn't it? The vastness of the universe doesn't diminish us, rather, it offers us an infinite canvas on which to paint our narratives, our stories, our art, our science, our achievements. These are the ways we assert our presence in the universe. They are the threads we weave into the cosmic tapestry. They are the echoes we send into the void, a testament of our existence, our quest for understanding, our insatiable curiosity, our relentless pursuit of knowledge. These are the hallmarks of our species. They are our response to the silent call of the cosmos. The human spirit in its resilience and ingenuity shines brightly against the backdrop of cosmic darkness. Our search for meaning might seem daunting amidst the cosmic vastness, but therein lies the canvas for us to paint our own narratives. We are the universe experiencing itself, and in that profound realization we find our place in the cosmos. Yes, we are but a speck in this grand cosmic theater, but remember this, it's a theater that we have the power to shape, to influence, to understand. And that, my friends, makes us infinitely significant. The awe of the universe's vastness is matched only by the beauty of our quest to understand it. This quest is not just about the stars and galaxies out there, but also about us, about who we are and our place in this grand cosmic tableau. As we journey through the cosmos, each discovery, each revelation brings us closer to understanding the fabric of the universe and, in turn, ourselves. We are, after all, made of stardust. The same atoms that make up the stars and galaxies are the ones that constitute us. The iron in our blood, the calcium in our bones, all were once forged in the heart of a star, billions of years ago. In a very real sense, we are the universe experiencing itself. But what does this mean? It means that we are not separate from the universe. We are a part of it. Our existence, our consciousness, is a way for the universe to know itself. This profound realization can change our perspective, make us feel connected to something larger than ourselves. And this connection is not just philosophical, it's tangible. Every time we gaze up at the night sky, we're looking at our own cosmic origins. Every time we push the boundaries of our knowledge, we're not just learning about distant stars and galaxies, but also about ourselves. In this vast cosmic journey, we find purpose. Each step we take into the unknown is a step towards understanding the universe and our place in it. We are explorers, pioneers, stargazers. Our thirst for knowledge, our curiosity, is what propels us forward, what makes us reach for the stars. And as we continue to explore, we find that our quest is not just about understanding the universe, but also about understanding ourselves. We are a part of this grand cosmic story, a chapter in the universe's ongoing narrative. As we continue to reach for the stars, we realize that the universe, vast and mysterious as it may be, is our home and we, its children, are ever curious and ever reaching. So as we gaze into the cosmic sea, we are confronted with a profound realization. We are but tiny inhabitants of a universe so vast it defies comprehension. From the mind-boggling enormity of the cosmos estimated at 93 billion light-years in diameter to the awe-inspiring journey of cosmic understanding that has evolved from the naked eye to telescopes, satellites and space probes, we've come a long way. We've peered into the depths of space, sending messages from Earth into interstellar space and have contemplated our existence, our purpose and our place in this seemingly indifferent cosmos. Yet, despite the existential dread, there's a beauty to our quest. With the universe experiencing itself, finding connection and purpose in its vast expanse, in the grand scheme of things, we may be but a speck on a pale blue dot, 